Hey T fam, welcome back to another video and if you're new here, hi my name is Tamina and I make university lifestyle content as well as fashion content and for today, give me a minute Okay, uh, <laughs> we're going to be reviewing my favorite product of the year just because I wanted to do a monthly favorites video I wanted to be like guys, these are my favorite products um, in October but then I realized, wait sis, you can't do this video because you've never done it the whole year and you've used this product consistently throughout the year so I decided why don't we just make this a yearly favorites video where I can show you all my items and products that I've been loving throughout the year and I'm going to have to do what a mom never has to do and that is choose her favorite children some of them are here just because I don't like them <laughs> And I'm here to tell you the tea and I'm here to tell you not to waste your money on some of these things But some are here just because I absolutely love them and would 10 out of 10, 11 out of 11 100 out of 100 recommend this product So let's just get to the video <laughs> Wait, I should definitely take a thumbnail like Okay guys, so the first item that we have to review is the very first step when you're going to shower. Oh wait, I did I mention that I'm going to divide this video into three. I'm going to divide this video into body care, hair care, and skin care. I'm going to combine hair care and skin care all together just because I already have a skin care video. And if you haven't watched that, I'm just going to put it like somewhere up here. And then for the hair care video, I'm just going to show you what I've been enjoying. But if you guys want a separate video on how I grew out my hair and everything, you can definitely tell me in what's those things called in the comments in the comments down below you can definitely just mention that you'd like a video on that because i did a big chop earlier in like february last year and then my hair just is a huge afro now so if you'd want to know those tips of course i'm going to share the secret you know of course so the first thing that we obviously do when you wake up or oh wait there are those people who shower at night and then they don't shower in the morning but for most people who shower in the morning you obviously use shower gel so for me my favorite shower gel ever 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 is this one it's the it's the St. Ives puppet <laughs> it's the St. Ives pampering vanilla wash and just to show you proof because you know I just I'm obsessed with showing evidence that I use this product here's a product empty and here's the new one that we've restocked and I love this shower gel so much I also reduced the prices for St. Ives it used to be like a thousand and something but now it's kind of reduced for this smaller one and it's around I think 800 which is not as bad but there are also some really affordable um shower gel I don't know where I threw the packet by XVC and this one's are super affordable it's like 300 and they smell really nice and they also really just do the trick so yeah that's it for shower gels, the next thing, okay, when you come out of the shower, the next thing that you probably do is come out of the shower. Wait, 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 we have a body scrub. So this is the brand I'm talking about, XBC. Okay, well, let me just... Yeah, so XBC, this one is a cleansing charcoal face and body scrub. It's also cleansing, revitalizing, purifying, paraben and sulfate free. Wow guys, do you even usually know what like parabens are? I know what sulfates are but I don't know what parabens are, I just know they're dangerous. So yeah, I use this scrub a couple of times in the shower. As I said, this brand is pretty affordable because this scrub I think was either 250 or 300 compared to other scrubs that's like a steal. So I, I liked it, it had the microbeads were not too rough but for the body I feel like they should be big because your skin is not as sensitive as your face. But then, it really did the job. I liked it. I love it a lot. Let me just read for you what it does. It's, suppo it's supposed to have charcoal and walnut kernel to gently cleanse, exfoliate, and stimulate your skin by helping remove excess oil and dead skin cells to remove what to reveal healthier looking skin and it's suitable for all skin types i totally recommend this scrub i think you can find it um in the chandaranas as well as the i think the chandaranas yeah so the next thing we're going to be talking about is body oil and this is where oh my god body oil can just make you look like a totally glowy like you know you just scream cocoa butter shea butter black girl magic and that's what we're, we're aiming for so for body oils i tried three body oils this year and this it's the um the first one i tried was the dr teals let me just show you the dr teals body lotion let me tell you oh my god i don't know what you're gonna do i feel like your heart is gonna palpitate i feel like you're gonna fall in love when i read for you this ingredients so it has coconut oil 
essential oils with cocoa butter, shea butter, and vitamin E. Oh, isn't that just music to black girl tears? Like, what? Okay, so it has all these, and they even tell you, like, coconut oil is nourishing. They tell you shea butter is skin softening. They tell you cocoa butter is moisturizing, and vitamin E is protective. This was really good, especially because it had all those oils in one product. And I think it retailed for around 900, but for you to get coconut oil, cocoa butter, shea butter, vitamin E oil, and some essential oils, I don't know which essential oils, I feel like it's a really good price. I'm trying to read the oil. Oh, I can see there's lavender oil. Mm, okay. Okay, yeah, but I really loved this oil. I felt like it really gave me that like black girl glow. Yeah, I finished it and never bought another one. I don't know why. The next one that I went to was the Vaseline Cocoa Glow, I feel like, oh my god, you get the same glow from the Dr. Teals for a much cheaper price. And the last one that I tried was the Ole. Yeah, the Ole Quench um, Body Lotion. This is just the Orchid and Black Current one. This one smells amazing, but it also, let me tell you, this one actually, it really gives you a glow. <laughs> oh it really gives you a glow like wow guys this is a really good product actually i just forgotten how much of a glow it used to give me but then let me tell you the other black girl secret i use all this oils and i mix them with baby oil this is just baby oil from baby johnson's and this is what gives you the glow okay this is what gives you the glow because i mix all my oils with this but with most of the oils that i have here even though you don't mix it you won't at you still glow but this one just gives you an extra an extra glow <laughs> yeah so that's basically it for my body oils I would 10 out of 10 recommend the Vaseline Coco Glow the Olay um, quench body lotion and the Dr. Teal's one the Olay what the Olay quench body lotion is a plus just because it makes you smell like black currants you just smell like a snack you really just smell like a snack yeah so the next thing we're gonna be talking about is pads ladies and gentlemen Gentlemen who are watching this, if you're period phobic, uh, what, what, what? Why would you be period phobic? Why would you sh- uh, Let's not even get into it. So for pads, my favorite, favorite, favorite pads ever. Wait, let me just start with the- I have to call out this one. Mm. Where is it? Is it disappearing so I don't call it out? Okay, I found it. So the pads that, um, for me, it's just a no. Are the always pads <laughs> it's a no from me always it's just a no from me period did you see what i did there okay that's funny guys that's actually funny so for me always is a no because it irritates my skin a lot i don't know i just i don't like it it's not i don't find it comfortable and it's really 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 irritated my skin it's a no from me it's just a no from me and the one that receives a yes from me is the um cotton they just look like this okay this pads i have to say they're on the more expensive side but this cotton's maxi pads with wings are just amazing there was a day i had worn one of these pads and you know what i was panicking why i had forgotten i'd worn a pad and i thought i'd come out of the house without wearing one and i was so stressed my level was my anxiety level was like here and then i went to the loo to check and you guys know what i had a pad <laughs> This is a true story, as in, wow, that's how comfortable they are. I love these pads, and they're super, 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 super thick. So if you have a very heavy flow, then I would 10 out of 10 recommend cotton pads. They're very thick. I would recommend Cortex as well, but for the Cortex ones, I don't feel like they have the super thick ones if you have a heavy flow. I feel like they do well for like um, the ultra thin ones. So I love the Cortex for the thin ones, and then I love the co cotton ones for the thick ones. And speaking of Cortex, I would also 10 out of 10 recommend their panty liners um i just love them they're also very comfortable they don't i don't know they're just really nice and i love how they put i feel like cortex put a lot of thought into like their packaging and just everything i feel like they really look out for a girl's best interest you know so cottons and cortex receive a yes from me 10 out of 10 would recommend them okay yay okay <laughs> so the next thing we have here guys is dio and for me, I totally, um, I love Dio. I don't think, is there anyone who doesn't use Dio? Wow, well, I don't know. <laughs> so for me, my two best Dio's, I use the Fa. So I first tried this, it's called Fiji Dream. Okay, why isn't it focusing? 
So there's Fiji Dream and then um, I just bought the Hawaii Love one and I love this too. The thing about Dio is I had that. You're not supposed to buy an antiperspirant. Yeah, this is a... I just said that and I just saw antiperspirant written down here. I've been lied to, I've been lying to myself. But you're not supposed to use deals with aluminium because I had, first of all, they really block your pores. It doesn't let your lactic acid leave your pores, thus making your armpits kind of darker. But I've been really loving this too um, for deodorants. That's all I gotta say. Maybe. God. Maybe I think if your aluminium content is like less, then maybe it's safer. I don't know, guys. I'm gonna do my research and I'm gonna come back. So yeah, after Dio, obviously the next thing we need to talk about is perfumes, scents and all that stuff. So my favorite scent of this year has hands down been the this one. So it's called Boom Sweet Lollipop and it's from Jean Arthas. Jean Arthas. I do French and I cannot even pronounce that name. Why have I been doing French? So it's, yeah, that's just the name of the um, perfume. It's just called Sweet Lollipop and it literally smells like a sweet lollipop. I love smelling like something sweet. I love smelling like cake, like, like candy. That's just my signature scent. That's basically it for body care. And I think now we're gonna head on to skincare and hair care and yeah. Before we continue, I realized I look super naked when I watched back my footage, so <laughs> we're just gonna pull my off shoulder tail like here. So wait, I realized I was being super, what's the word? I don't know what the word is, when I was like, oh yeah, you obviously use shower gel. Okay. So if you use bar soap, you know, same, I also use bar soap sometimes. So if you use bar soap, this is the bar soap I've been really loving. This is the Far Pink Passion Pink Rose Bar Soap and yeah, I just feel like all the Far Bar Soaps are bomb. They smell really nice. I like this one and the orange one. Okay, so first I think we should just get skincare out of the way because that's the one I'm going to be talking about least because as I said, I already have a skincare video up and again, I'm going to selfish, selfishly promote myself by saying I'll link it somewhere up here guys so you can go watch it. <laughs> so for skincare, um, I have some products that I think I've not shown you but I like my favorite favorite products that make you really glowy so the first thing obviously okay i think if you follow my instagram you've seen me always doing you know boomerangs showing you my face mask so the first face mask face mask max first you know the way some people say ask and then some people say axe anyway the first face mask is this um Garnier Skin Active Tissue Mask Hydro Bomb. Um, for me, when I do masks, I really look for stuff that's hydrating. Just because after like I scrub or I do my two skincare regimens, I feel like my skin gets really dry and this is the last step that I usually do before I moisturize. So I just really put like a face mask and then I seal it in and then I moisturize because I feel like that really does the trick and makes you really super glowy. Like when you're done using this mask, let me take a breath. <laughs> When you're done using this mask, you're going to be glowing, you're going to look like, oh my god, you eat all your fruits, you drink all your water, you got your life together, you're doing everything sis, you're just a boss babe, okay? And yeah, that's just it for the first um, skincare product that I've been loving that I haven't shown you guys. The second thing is just this grapeseed moisturizing spray, seated over here, watery. <laughs> it's literally written, watery. <laughs> So, um, and then they're gonna, they go ahead, they're like, water me, H2O. <laughs> so, um, this is, um, um, what is this? A moisturizing spray. Let me show you how it looks. You know what? I feel like I'll just put, like, I'll be inserting a picture here of how the product looks. So, this one is just grapeseed moisturizing spray. It's from Miniso. And let me tell you guys, this thing, I usually just do my skincare, then after that, I, I spray some, and then I do my makeup or something, and it makes you look so dewy. Makes you look so glowy. Yeah. We have come to the end of this video. Sadly, I really just feel like taking all the products from the whole house and just showing them to you guys. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't. And if you feel like you want to join the family, please subscribe. And yeah, welcome to our family if you do. And I feel like that's it. What else do we usually say? I'll see you guys in the next video. And yeah, I'm opening school next week. I've pre-recorded two videos this weekend, so 
we have content coming spicy content coming and i'll miss you guys so much and i'll make sure i see you guys in the next one yeah till then bye tfam wait you guys i forgot if you reach this part of the video make sure to comment olive and the comment shout out for the week yeah i started doing comment shout outs because i thought let me just shout out you guys so the comment shout out of the week goes to um rita mweni um rita mweni sorry <laughs> Anyway, she commented, Gel, instead of reading for my exams, I'm here commenting, Gel. It's the love I got for you. That's so cute. Thank you so much. I love you guys so much. And thank you so much for the support. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye, Tifa. Not for real. Like, bye, Tifa. <laughs>